welcome everybody to our finally finished showroom. Um, it has been a little bit of a work in progress and a little bit late um, coming to you all, but um, we finally got there yesterday. A few little things still to arrive, but we're 90% there and it's um, been really fun. The team have worked so hard together and this is probably one of the first times that we've actually de decorated and redecorated this place as part of a team and every single person who has been part of this has been amazing and thank you to you all so much because it hasn't been easy the last few days here so I'm gonna get into it really quickly so we have got um a lovely bedroom which can be either for children or a spare room we've got a bedroom suite we've got our new furniture collection um on display we have a room which we are calling our London townhouse we have a little boot room um and we also have a little home office and we have a drawing room we also have this gorgeous open plan living area which we always have here and um, we really wanted to try and make it different than it was before it's always really really tricky and um, we're starting to decorate because we see so much every day and there are so many things that are new every day to us that we say oh we'll do this we'll do that and it's just so difficult people come in here just and they say to us i just can't make a decision and i say I totally understand that because even when we're decorating here, it's so difficult to make a decision. And even when there's so many designers around us here, everyone has uh, their own opinion of what they think works. So it does take time and it takes patience. And for that, to for something really good to happen, it takes time. And I always say to my clients when decorating, take your time. Because if you rush into these things, you just make decisions in haste. Have a look and there's so many different things out there to look at, but I always think you just take your time and you know, people say, is it worth getting an interior designer? Yes, it is, because when you use an interior designer, you're you're showing so many different things that you wouldn't see yourself on normal, uh, you're normally looking. So definitely, I think you should be using somebody to give you a hand if you're struggling. If you're not struggling, you know, work away. Um, so favorite room probably is gonna be the spare bedroom that we've decorated this time. It's totally something I've had in my head for so long. The colours in it are just my colours and anyway I'm going to start giving you a really quick tour and what I will do over the next week is I'm going to actually explain to you how we came up with this concept. We'll probably start that I'd say in about two weeks time we'll do a video or probably next weekend or the weekend after we fill up. Anyway we will start by um, set out mood boards of how we get to the, the concept right through to design and therefore you'll give you that. It's really interesting to see but it's fun. So this is our middle area. And because it's the time of year, we've decorated really beautifully with all these autumn colours. We've got uh, lovely moss greens, we've got this lovely um, hand embroidered uh, cushions. We've got some boucle as well, and all the colours really, although there's, believe it or not, four different colours of velvet in this room, it all works together beautifully. And these lovely shades we have, um, and unfortunately, these are the last of what we've got, but we, these are ones we make ourselves in India. and. The colours just worked so well together with them that we were just thrilled. So I will walk this way, leave the best for last, Philippa. This is our sort of reception area where clients wait to go into meetings, but it's a lovely area we've got. Um, we've used greater paints throughout. Um, this is half barrel, and it's teamed up with this lovely, um, almost like a mossy green wallpaper, it's textured. We've used probably 80% of the fabrics we use um, on the big piece of furniture are all stock of what we have ourselves here. Um, these lovely Alba chairs are lovely chairs to use in a hallway um, because they're really comfortable. They're great desk chair as well. They're also very nice um, if you're going to have like a morning room or you can sit around a table. They're very comfortable. So this is um, what we call our reception area. The next room isn't really finished because our sofas haven't arrived, but I'll give you a quick glimpse and then I'll do it when the sofas come back next week, I'll show you. So this is our um, sort of formal living area. We've got this lovely wall here, which is higher than and ended up evolving. I saw the wall here and fell totally in love with it. I love the depth of the color in it. It's, and it's teamed up beautifully, um, again, with creator color. And can I remember the name of it for the life of me? Um, I don't even, well, I'll find out anyway, I'll put it on Instagram. Sorry, um, that's going to drive me mad now. But anyway, again, all the different fabrics again are all stock. We've used our herringbones, our linens, our ticking. The sofa in here actually is going to be gorgeous. It's going to be a black and white ticking, so it's going to look great. 
This is our um, beautifully done, um, let's say home office, L-shaped sofa. We get last lot for L-shaped sofa. This is painted in marsh ground, also from Creator. It's one of those colors that I just love. I love that olivey um, green color. It's really soothing to live with. And it also it's so cozy. Um, we've cheated it up with these again, lovely hand embroidered cushions. And these pattern chairs are also part of our stock. And um, the velvet's in stock as well. Um, and size of rugs, all of them, again, we ordered them to, we ordered them made into order. This is our lovely little boot room. And again, probably we ended up going with this because of the reason, again, I love the wallpaper. It's pretty, it's feminine. It's something I don't use very often, but again, I love the little dot, the little flower, and I just, I just thought it was cute. Again, we've teamed it up with these lovely chairs, this beautiful tablecloth as well, which is, we're making so many tablecloths now rather than get people, want, people wanting to have texture and lots more color in their house. So we're finding that people are asking for pattern way more than ever did before. We've also got this little window seat teamed up with our um, gorgeous Indian cushions, which look, this the mustard color looks so pretty in here against the, um, Woodwork colour again, all painted in creator. And really interestingly, um, if you come into store and if you see this little barcode, as you do in a restaurant, just hit the barcode really nicely here, and all the information of the room will come up in your phone and answer all the questions you need to answer. So it's really simple. And also, what happens is it'll tell you size of the sofa, the price of the sofa. So instead of having to um ask one of the girls if no, no one's around, it's much easier. And also you can snap it on your phone and save it if you want to, so it's really simple. So this is our lovely townhouse. Um, I had these chairs in my own house, so I had so many feedback on Instagram about them that I ended up um, putting them into the store because everyone loved them. Um, again, the wallpaper was really pretty and very easy, to, easy on the eye. I love the depth of the color on it. Um, we took the bar that used to be here and had a lovely window seat. We have our curtains still coming. But again, it's just very simple, the reds, the pinks, and the blues. And again, blue is one of my favorite colors. It just looks so smart together. Um, and then in here, we've got the uh, furniture room, which is um, all our pieces that we've left in stock at the moment, all um, displayed, and we'll have more pieces in um, in the beginning of November, all restocked again. But it's a great way to display them. And again, we have on the wall the barcode. So if you um, do the barcode, our whole furniture brochure will come up for you. And you can see all the pieces in it. So it's very straightforward to use. So we'll come into our, our bedroom suite. And um, this is just something that we've used for so long because um, so much of the houses we do have got bedrooms that have bathrooms off them or on suites. And it's just nice to be able to showcase the half testers, something we're making a lot of at the moment again. Uh, and just layering lots of color and texture. And I think it's, we're sort of getting away. People now, as I said earlier, really want a bit more luxurious in their home. They like the texture, they like color. So uh, it gives you an idea of what you can do. And then for the last room, which is my favorite, as I said, it is, um, the spare room. So I absolutely, everything in this room is, I love about it. It's cozy, it's warm. It's just, every time I come here, I just feel like it gives you a big hug. It's everything that I like. I love the little helmets on top, it's so pretty. The headboards are beautifully banded in the check all the way around, so the detail in it is just second to none. Um, the gold again is something that I would never have used in a bedroom but as I started working with it recently I'm using it a lot because it's just one of those colours it just it always feels just cosy and welcoming I mean the little beds these can be made at any size as well but it's just really interesting um, how even though the beds are three foot they look so much bigger and they for the first time this room has actually felt really like it's found us where it is. Every time we got it before, it was a little bit missing something. So these little pelmets, especially with the bulkhead coming out, looks great. So we look forward to welcoming you to the store. Um, any questions, the girls are here all the time. But again, 
barcodes are here as i said and it just makes it so much easier for you guys and if you have any questions dm me and i hope you all have a lovely weekend